from one of, if not the most congested interchanges in North Carolina. This is I-85 near I-485 in the western part of Mecklenburg County. This is actually Olympic High School, but trust me, that intersection's a mess. If you've been anywhere near this area, You've probably seen the mess that it can become pretty much any time of the day. I know, but some good news here yeah. is that your commute in that area near the airport, as Jamie said, might be improving sooner mm -hmm. rather than later. Yeah, the interchange of I-485 and 85 set to get a multi-million dollar redesign. WBTV's Claire Kopsky is live near that intersection tonight. And Claire, we all know that place can be a big headache. Well, Molly and Jamie, especially at rush hour, this 45 85 interchange right behind me truly can be the source of road rage and a true headache. A $45 million investment announced this week to improve your drive time. We're told the original plan had the project slated to be finished by 2033, but thanks to the state's discretionary fund, the project has been bumped up to be completed by 2025. We're told the change to this intersection should also improve traffic at the airport. Representative Tim Moore described what he's seen as the issue. Right now, you have 485 South coming in with all those lanes into, into one. You have 485 from the north coming in, and all that traffic gets funneled into one lane. And, and I've described it before as a goat rodeo. That's about the best way I know, dude. It just all gets put in there and causes everything to freeze up. With this announcement, that means that there is bound to be construction and some delays to come here in the months ahead. So that means, Molly and Jamie, that it's likely to become a little bit more of a headache before it gets better. We'll send it back to you. Light at the end of the tunnel, though, in the next few years. Claire, thank you.